Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Gaming Weekly Update. This is your host, Kieran. And welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider 4, The Last Revelation. In this episode, we start the level known as Alexandria. Well, this is the city known as Alexandria. So, yep. That was what the cutscene said in the previous area that we traveled on. And that's what we were on the train for because we were reaching Alexandria. And there's going to be guys around here. So we're going to go shoot these dudes. So boom. This is quite a short level. So there's not a whole lot of, of things that go on here. So anyway. There's nothing around that door. So we enter this door. And as soon as I go up these steps, there's going to be another cutscene that's going to be triggered for you folks to watch. So I'll stay quiet and let you watch. La, you are alive. I feared for you. What's... Von Croy has the amulet. Ah, this is bad. But he doesn't yet have the armor. There is still time to prepare for set. Jean, I'm tired. Give a girl a break. My dear, when all this is over, you can retire. But now we must move swiftly. My men dive in the bay for remnants of Cleopatra's lost palaces. Cleopatra? Yes. She realized the armor's significance and had it brought here. Some was subsequently scattered, but... And where would you recommend I start looking? In the catacombs under Alexandria. My diggers have unearthed chambers connected to the Great Library. This would hold the true location of Cleopatra's palaces. We have yet to find a way in, but you... Take me there. There is a problem. Von Croy. Yes. His dig is expanding, crossing many of my own tunnels. Of course, my men would no longer work when Von Croy's thugs appeared on the scene. Time to introduce myself to Werner's loyal workforce. First, you must get into the catacombs. Von Croy has them completely sealed up, and I fear he will soon have the armor. Over my dead body. This I fear also. I shall wait here for news. Return if you feel I can help in any way. Good luck, Clara. I fear you may need it. I make my own luck. So, yep, a lot of useful information there from um, Jean Yves. So, let's go and um, pick up these shotgun shells. And he's got a lot of useful items here, too. So, we've got. We can pick them up. So, we've got laser scope, we've got arrows, and we've got shotgun shells. So,. Yep. Very bizarre how he's got ammo like in his in his little office, but I think he knew that um Lara would be in trouble eventually, so he knew he's like, I got you covered. Oh, I need to get my shotgun out. <laughs> shotgun would be nice. There we go. Right, so bang this guy. Boom. There's another dude over here. There you go. So after we shoot him. Oh, let's not go down here first. What we actually want to do is get the one and only secret of this level. And to get the secret, you've got to... Basically... Oh, uh, hold on. <laughs> gonna run and jump over here. Grab this. And it just shimmy towards this lever right here. You drop down. Grab that lever. Opens that door right here there's a thing that's oh gosh well it op it doesn't open that door but it opens this one there we go the secret in the library so yep so in total there should be 44 secret yep so there's only one secret in this level so we're going to First off, go down here and get whatever this is. And we pick them up. Yep, these are Uzi clips. And I think Jean Yves has got some stuff that he wants to tell you too. So we'll go back to him in a second. But we're going to go around here and deal with these dudes that should be around here. 
I'm not mistaken. I'm sure there's dudes here. Yep. One right here. I knew there was dudes here. I knew it. Knew it. <laughs> okay, so. We've done about that much. So what we do next is, like I said, we go back to the library. Well, not the library, but back to where jean is in his office because i think he's got some info that he has to tell you so if it triggers here then i'll stay silent and let you watch the cutscene this time it's not a cinematic like we just saw it'll be like literally oh my lordy lord where did you come from you son of a gun anyway gonna stay silent and let you watch this cutscene if it triggers so hang tight It did not trigger, so... Yep, I do not know what I'm missing. So... I think there's other dudes around here that you gotta shoot too, so... I'm almost certain that's the case, but... Probably haven't looked hard enough to... At least that's what happened in the game that... In the videos that I've been watching. Like, to refresh my memory, but... Ah, well, there you go. There's some ammo here, but as you can see, there's a flipping motorbike in there. So, yep. There's a lot of places to explore around this area. So, this is probably going to be the longest in the series. Well, I mean, the longest area, anyway. So, I don't know if Sean Yeezus' cutscene is going to trigger now. Because I've explored as much as I could. More information? We? Oui? I believe some of the armor could be here in the town. <clears throat> A local collector had a small exhibition and was rumored to own a piece. It's hard to say this is true. The man was a fool. A while back, he vanished, leaving the exhibition boarded up. So, if Von Croy hasn't got to it, perhaps this would be the place to begin. Okay, so the cutscene did trigger, so... He gave us a couple of information. It's something to do with, like, the... The armor of Horus. So, what we do next is oh, well, I didn't want to equip the pistols. I wanted to equip my shotgun. There's gonna be another dude down here. We're gonna shoot him, and we'll pick up whatever this item is. If he, I think he drops an item. Yeah, he dropped one right here. There's no health back. So, yep. As soon as I go down this corridor right here, that is gonna be the end of the level. So, let's check the statistics. So, 3 hours, 8 minutes, 21 seconds, 22222 meters that we've traveled, um, 1768 ammo used, no health packs, and we got 44 out of 70 secrets. So, that has been Alex Andrea of Tomb Raider 4, The Last Revelation. So, that also concludes the video. So, thank you very much for watching, and as per usual, if you liked what you've seen, Please like, comment, and subscribe. Remember to hit the bell if you want to see any more videos or any more live streams that me or Brad produce on this channel. I've been Kieran of Gaming Weekly Update, and we will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, and goodbye.